If you're getting a bit frustrated with trying to figure out how to just use the dry only function on the LG washer dryer, this is the video for you. I'll jump into it right now. And remember, this is part of my longer video on how to use it and get all the functions you need. So be sure to check that after watching this video. I'll put a link in this video for that. Here we go. Enjoy. If you do want to just a dry cycle, turn it on without touching the dial. Just press dry. It's a bit confusing because again that light on the dial is still lit up and then you've got your dry options and I can press it you know it'll be 30 etc but if I leave it whoops this is going through the full cycle of drying options if I leave it and just press play it will then calculate how long it thinks it needs so that's the one we use all the time and it is actually trying to do that now a standard let's say drying cycle wash and dry cycle is about three hours 30 for us just note that as you see here, the two-in-one combo, the direct drive is eight kilos of laundry, but five kilos only for drying. So if you are going to do a wash and dry cycle, don't overdo it, because obviously that can't handle it. Yeah, and if you did enjoy this, then please check out the link I've got to this below. If you're in the UK, for, we bought this from AO.com. It was really good. They do a nice service. They took out our old one as well. So be sure to check that out. Help support the channel. If you enjoyed the video give us a subscribe to help me support this and i can do a few more videos like this on different topics around the home and different products and let you know but this lg washer dryer has been great for us hope you found this video useful i'll talk to you soon thanks for watching